bill entitled the Tax Procedures Code Bill Code Amendment Bill. During the plenary sitting, government tabled 11 bills including the Excise Duty Amendment Bill 2022, the Value Added Tax Amendment Bill 2022, the Tax Procedures Code Amendment Bill 2022, the Income Tax Amendment Bill 2022, the Stamp Duty Amendment Bill 2022, and Uganda Revenue Authority Amendment Bill 2022, among others. I beg to move that the bill entitled the Value Added Tax Amendment Bill 2022 be read for the first time. Minister Musasizi explained that the amendment in the Traffic and Road Safety Amendment Bill 2022, government seeks to clarify the ban on imported cars from the 15-year proposal and scaled down. We are looking at ways of reducing the number of years so that the country is able to receive, to import in new vehicles like other other jurisdictions do. It should be recalled that in 2018-2019 financial year, Parliament approved a proposal by government to amend the Traffic and Road Safety Act to, among others, varying motor vehicle registration fees provided in for the Finance Act 2013, varying the environmental levy on motor vehicles, and a ban on importation of motor vehicles above eight years from the date of manufacture. Parliament, however, approved the request cutting the period from eight years and slapping 15 years for all vehicles. Musasizi says that the new changes seek to define the particular vehicles. What we are bringing in now is just the definition of which vehicles are these. It's just to specify the number of years. It is when you look at it, I will come to the committee and present the bill formally. But it is not that we are introducing something new, but we are just streamlining. The minister also rejected claims that the skyrocketing prices are a result of high taxes. It is not correct that some people are saying the prices of goods, of these essential goods, is too high uh, and putting it on taxation. There are other factors rather than taxation. The file was compiled by Sarah Nakandi for CTV. PM edition.